Okay, one thing uh, as well that, uh, that I did, I added the magnets, so when you actually push on the bullet, of course, that slides out. So I'm going to go ahead and remove that, set that aside. This is the 3D printed 007 uh, the bullet, so I'll go ahead and set that aside here. Um, so when it's open, there is a magnet here to keep it from dropping back in, and there's also a magnet on the top to keep it from just falling out. So there is a magnet on either end, again, to keep it uh, locked in place so it's not flopping around. But it does have a tendency to be, be loose, even with the magnet. Okay, so I made some changes uh, as well in that to improve uh, on the, um, uh, the print and, and, the, and the actual usage of the, uh, the prop itself. So I'm going to go ahead and show you that here. Let me slide this open again. Okay, and now the pen. There's been some changes in the pen. Um, this is the cap that goes on the end, which is removable uh, to reveal the threads down here. But uh, I, the issue with that is the, the cap tended to uh, want to wear out and just fall off. So I actually made mine uh, with threads. So uh, the cap now is actually threadable as well as this, the threads that are in the, the end piece here. So I'm going to go ahead and unthread that. Uh, you may notice something right here. Now this is another added piece that I uh, added to the uh, to the prop itself um, is this piece here. So let me go ahead and push on that. Okay, and what happens is there's a, a simulated uh, brass end of the bullet here, which actually when it's here it actually caps off the hole on the end here so again it looks like a finished uh, pen there's no there's no visible hole even though uh, without that that is the actual um, nozzle or the the end of the barrel right there so um, basically this uh, piece of aluminum, aluminum uh, tubing comes out of there and the reason I did that is so that it can help reinforce the uh, portion here so that it doesn't flop around so the way that works is I've mushroomed this end piece out right here so it doesn't fall through and you put it in the end right here. Let me, uh, let me put that in there like that. Okay, you can see it sticks out right here. Okay, so when this is all the way out, the aluminum piece is flush right here and it's actually uh, set up so that when I thread this, let me grab this here, when I thread this in, the aluminum piece is actually held uh, pretty tightly in place. And let me go ahead and turn the, the barrel so it's, uh, or the pen part, so it's toward the top right there. Okay, so there we go. We got that. Now, what this does, when I took the, the, the brass piece or the, the end of the bullet out, it now fits back on the end of the aluminum piece right here on the end. And that actually keeps it solid. Okay, you don't hear that clankety clank. It's actually, it's actually solid now. Okay. So that's what uh, what I did is when I added the aluminum piece here, it extends all the way to here and partially up into the uh, the barrel to keep it from from flopping around. Okay, so then you open this up here like that, like you're supposed to. You have your little catch right here. This is where you actually slide it into here. And the, w the reason for this pin is it slips right into this slot right there and it keeps this portion from moving back and forth as well because there's so much slop in it that uh, it, again it cheapened it so I went ahead and added this pin so that it actually goes in there as a guide and that locks in like that. So again it's nothing nothing flops around so this is tight so it doesn't go side to side and of course the same applies uh, with the cap it would actually be tight on there and it wouldn't flop around all right I'm gonna go ahead and put the uh, cuff link in uh, let me go ahead and put this the the end cap on here just to get it so we can see what it looks like okay so we got that okay so let me go ahead line this up and this is the uh, the cuff link that we saw earlier. Put this in this hole here like that. Thread it in. Okay. Make sure it's tight. Line it up like that. All right. So. Uh, that's it. So basically, uh, it'll be painted gold. Um, 
when the time comes, but uh, I think it turned out uh, pretty well, right? So you can see the end, the barrel in there, it's a pen, it's attached, it's solid, no flopping around. The uh, trigger uh, swivels back and forth. Um, yeah, and then of course we have our little trap door here with our uh, chewing gun there. So anyway, when it's uh, when it's painted, I'll uh, I'll go ahead and update uh, with uh, maybe a photo or two to show what it looks like. And there it is with the uh, the door open there. So uh, yeah, I think it uh, turned out pretty well. Thank you for watching.